Hello everyone, my name is Argama Witch and today I'm going to show you really quickly how I did my uh, glowy uh, outfit thing. Um, so all this was just made over in V-Roid. It's, you know, it, it, it's whatever. Um, but what we're really going to need to make kind of the glowy effect, there's two effects. There's one where these each white lines glue and then there was one where there was like an outline. Um, and we're gonna do the- we're gonna do both of them, but first we're gonna do the inner white glowy ones. So what you're gonna uh, do is come over to your textures, over in the assets, and you're gonna find the ones with the white marks on it, and you're gonna right click, and you're gonna go show and explore. A uh, window's gonna pop up, and it's going to show you all of your textures. You're gonna, um, grab that particular texture, and you're going to bring it into an editing program. Uh, now what I did is I grabbed all of the whites, um, I used an, an eyedropper, but you, you'd also, you might have to add some of those by hand. But what we're gonna need to do is separate everything we want glowing and put it on a new layer. Alright, once you've selected all of your whites, um, I'm going to make a new layer and I'm going to uh, fill it in so it's just the whites. And I'm gonna take um, a new layer in between. I'm gonna turn the whole thing black. Black. There we go. So basically what I'm doing here is everything that I want glowing is gonna be white and everything I don't is gonna be black. And now you're going to uh, save this as a new file. Um, you can name it whatever you want. I'm gonna call it glowy. And then we're going to go back over into our Unity program. Alright, now that we're in Unity, we're going to find our uh, glowy texture that we just made. And mine is... Make sure you don't save over the old image. Just make sure you save a new image. Alright, so here's mine and I'm gonna drop it into textures. Right, so there it is, you can kind of see it there. Now what I'm gonna do is come over to uh, materials. I'm gonna click on this. And over here on the emissions map I'm gonna click this little uh, dot with a circle in it. And you're gonna see a uh, all this stuff and I'm gonna find my glowy lines and I'm gonna put it there. Now I'm gonna change this to white. Oh, hold on, I think I have the old glowy lines, I want the new glowy lines. Yep, there we go. Um, and that's gonna make these glow. Uh, it'll it'll make it glow under certain circumstances. Yeah. Um, and now to do the rim lighting, which I did on uh, the body and the face. Well, you can see it's still on the face, but... Uh, first thing I'm gonna do is pick the color that I want, and I want a... kinda like a neon -y blue. I like that. Um, and I have the settings here at the... 0 .093, 4.5, and 0 .027 over in the room lighting. And you can adjust this to how you want it. I like that, it's fine. It, it, it really doesn't matter, it's whatever you want. I um, mean, you're gonna do this for all, all that you want to have that outer glow line. Um, I did it with the hair up here, with the neon hairs. And for the uh, emission, I just did the whole thing. I want the whole thing to be glowy. And that's pretty much it. Then you go to, uh, BRM, export humanoid, export, we're gonna grab this, yes. All right, then we're gonna open our VC face, and we can do this in VC face or Luppet or pretty much any program that does a bloom effect. You're gonna need just a little bit of a bloom effect here. We're going to find our avatar, open, there she is, select. Um, all 
All right, and as you can see here, oh, well, hold on. And turn off the VC face. There we go. Um, as you can see here, we still have the outer, the outer glow, um, but you're not really seeing much in the way of the glow on these things, and that's because you need this bloom effect. Ta ta! And if you do, don't cut out the edges. It'll help a little bit too. And you can adjust the intensity. Like if you just want a little glow, if you want like mega glow. Usually just a little bit helps. There, you can see on the black background, you add the enable. You can see like how intense it's going to be. And how much glow it's going to be. It's going to look better in a darker environment, but... Yeah. So, that's pretty much it. It's, it's fairly simple. Um, I again did it with the hair strands as well. And then the blue effect. Uh, the blue, blue rim lighting. Um, you can kind of see on the body, like you don't see it here. And then when I turn, you can kind of see it a little bit. Yeah. So it looks good. All right. If you uh, have any questions, you can uh, leave them down below and, uh, you know, like share and all that other shit. And I'll uh, see you later. All right. Bye.